Hello everybody and welcome back to Surviving Mars. Now, quick recap from the from the last one. We got quite a few research uh, thingies done and one is almost done here as well. We got the deep water extraction and we've already, well, we started to build the extractor over here uh, in, in this location. We've had to expand the, the scrubber a little bit so it just barely covers the water extractor because uh, it requires, what is it, machine parts for maintenance and we, we're not producing any machine parts just yet. But that will change very soon with the uh, changes in the domes. We've got the farming dome up and running. Uh, it's not producing a lot right now because we were only having a few people in here just to uh, get the soil quality up for the time being. But this may change in this episode. So, um... Yeah, I think I'm forgetting something. Oh yeah, we got the um, the ramp done. We got a few more breakthroughs here, and uh, we got four research anomalies still in there as well. So that is that is all good. I think we are gonna need some more concrete. So let's set up a route here, bringing co concrete in this location. Let's see, factory amplify. Oh, that is that's a good one. And uh, now I haven't. I should have maybe taken some time before we're starting to record this episode to really think about what we want to research next. But uh, let's let's do it together. So we got a couple of things queued up or already over here. Uh, let's see what else we need. We don't need emergency training, uh, science. Um, we've got the resource lab for the time being, so that's uh, it's nice. But maybe a little bit later. Let's see what else could we need. Uh, that's a no. Decorations have increased comfort, would be good. Martian-born resilience would, is also another nice one. I'm thinking of going into uh, one of those, maybe, uh, the, the wonders over here. Or another option is to go into terraforming. Uh, let's, let's see what else do we have. Uh, we don't need this. In fact, research amplification... They, we can amplify them. That actually would... Let's just add this here so we're not going to forget about it. And I think... That's another one, although we don't desperately need it right now. Let's see, in the robotics... Drones, we could... Actually, yeah. Let's queue up this for a second. What else do we have here? A network node, no, and then we got the two wonders over here. Uh, out of dome buildings require maintenance less often. Uh, maybe a mega dome. Well, let's see. There is. Mm, apartments. How quick is this? 1,500, so fairly quick. So maybe we'll just get this done, since it is very, very fast. And same with drone printing as well. And then we can come back to... I've already lost it. It was somewhere here. Yeah, research amplification. That could be the next one. So that's the more important things done over here. Obviously, the medical center and these things will be nice as well. Martian-born colonists graduated faster in the universities. Uh, okay, we've, we've got the things we need for the time being, so let's let's leave it at that. Let's check Meteor out... Incoming. Uh, ooh, okay, that answers our question. The uh, rockets do not get, get destroyed by the meteors, so... Uh, nice one, although it did destroy the landing pad, it seems. Which is interesting, but uh, that's alright. Uh, now, let's see. We're producing 7 water per so. Oh, that is actually nice. And uh, we need to increase the range of the scrubber. Oh, it's already maximum. Okay, so... And it's just outside the range as well. So that is looking good. Oh yeah, it doesn't take any people as well. Now let's see our population. Okay, I think we're gonna have to allow them to start making some babies again. This dome isn't doing so good, so... Let's see, it's not showing me why, but I think it is because we don't have... Oh, but that's gonna take another... 
small slot over here. Uh, okay, I guess I guess we'll we're gonna have to lose another spot in here then. I mean, there isn't another way, right? I mean, once we get the botanist, then maybe we can, you know, change a few things around. But for the time being, they are going to need some more services, such as the diner. So let's put this one in here, and let's speed up the time as well. And I do think they they also might need another... Uh, I don't know, let's, let's put uh, alleys over here. Just like so. And uh, two people are looking for work. Well, that's getting a little empty over here. Which is not ideal. One homeless person. Um, <laughs> what can we do? Their comfort is fine. Social and gaming. I mean, they should get social from... What is it? From from here. And that's okay as well. How many renegades? We've got three renegades in here. Okay. Oh, they cannot go into this dome. So maybe we'll just open up a couple more slots in here. Actually, I don't think we need it. Since we have... Oh, quick autosave. Yeah. We have some people... Uh, are we gonna waste ah uh, let's see well it seems our electronics production is pretty good i mean it does show that you know we're we're not uh, positive but the thing is everything is covered by the by the scrubbers right now so so yeah and maybe we can afford another upgrade here so that way we can have those people working in the other buildings instead i wish we could have the what is it the um uh for words the university up and running that would be very nice nice to have but okay we are getting some more concrete in here as well what were we researching was this one okay then performance i suppose that's good as well uh yeah those tomes are really small ah. like or maybe i'm just like you know using too many connections i think ideally we would only use one of the triangles triangle is over over here to connect up a few different domes but the thing is as you can see it's it's fully stacked over here we, we've got no uh, space at all so yeah wait should we boost this one here uh phil taking out the stem reconstruction and just having the university up and running first. I don't know. Let's see how many old people do we have. Seniors, five. So it's not like... Hmm. Yeah, I think we'll bump it. Well, push it down the list again. And now let's, let's get this um, research boosted by scanning I'll do I'll take two anomalies for the time being and then we'll bring you back let's see so the overall temperature of Mars is now 5.52% up now with the homeless people I mean we got six vacancies I suppose they are in the Nurseries, yeah, it does seem like so. The kids are in school. Kind of want to get those people out from this dome. Uh, 
but then we are gonna need yeah blocking up those three spots is not ideal to say the least but maybe we'll, we can get to university over here i'm thinking and then eventually i could remove this playground once we put the next dome in in this location and then pull another anomaly analyzed from here nice thousand five hundred Okay, that gave us a nice uh, juicy boost over there. Now, let's take a look at this. Actually, let's just check again. What is the quickest way to get the soil quality up? Five souls, but 40%. Reported. Where? Oh, maybe we need more workers. Okay, let's do cover crops instead. And, you know, we'll put more workers in here. Actually, let's do this one first. Oh, we don't have enough workers. Research and complete. Anomaly analyzed. One second, please. Just to boost our farms. We'll have more people working here. Ooh, another 1,500. That's beautiful. So we got this... Uh, Martian born, they get 10, per uh, 10 performance. Flat Mars Society. Alright, we got another story bit over here. Sorry about this. Uh, a message is forwarded to your inbox with the most curious title Flat Mars Society. Hey, thinking it's a mere joke, you read through it and find out that a colonist by the name of Arto Starkiller who is born on Mars and has never been to space is propagating the notion that Mars is indeed flat, along with other conspiracy theories which naturally accompany such an idea. Our toast star killer has broken no laws thus far, but perhaps something should be done. I'm sure our colonists are reasonable enough uh, not to board that wacky train. People never change, I roll, whatever. Um, yeah, I think that would be me. I don't think it really matters which which option we choose in there. I, I think at least. Okay, so um, uh, let's uh, let's see. So this is filling up here. Yeah, we do want to get those cover crops. Uh, well, this is at the beginning, so let's let's switch it to cover crops. Uh, takes five souls, but hopefully with I don't know like four people in here, we should be able to have it done. Milestone achieved. 100 colonists. We got another 1,000 points in here, which means the next research, Martian research Education, complete. is now done as well. Okay, so let's let's slow it down just a little bit. We'll, we're going to have to rearrange some of the things in here. So first of all, do we need this many gardens? No, I don't think we need. So let's... Um, Let's put one over here. We're going to move our infirmary over as well. Uh, where is infirmary? Not in this one. Infirmary is here. Okay, we'll get those two things built. And then we're just going to destroy uh, these few things. At least for the time being. And I think one, with one of the rockets, let's you take you. Can we do some more meteors? Yes, we can. So we'll send this expedition out as well. And you are almost built, the new infirmary here. Once it is, we will demolish this one here. Actually, let's do it now. So here we go. Just turn off that. I don't know if you need to turn them off before destroying. I don't think so, but... I'll do it anyways. Okay, and now this means... Wait, we've got another garden over here. This means we can put the... Where is it? University. Alright. Beautiful. Once we get the university up and running, we can, we can start um, doing some uh, specialized uh, training for them. So I'm thinking maybe some botanists first in, in this dome to ensure that our food production is going to be, you know, up to the bar. 
And uh, with these going in now as well, maybe, let's see, oh, 19 vacancies. How so? Okay, let's, let's rearrange this over here. And seems like 10 is needed. I'm thinking of maybe making this uh, upgrade here as well with service spots. So we could have another six people that could potentially go and wo work elsewhere. Where do we have those 18? Oh yeah, there's a lot of jobs we have over here. A uh, lot, of, lot of kids studying in the school here. I really hope we get the uh, get the breakthrough for for like the oval or the triangle dome. That would be very awesome to have. Now with water, I'm actually not too worried about putting the spire in this one just yet, since our water production is pretty good. I don't. I mean, I don't even need to upgrade it just yet. We're getting enough uh, enough water in as it is. I am, however, thinking of maybe. Since our power situation seems fine over here, I'm thinking of maybe doing another GHG uh, factory in this location. But let's see. Um, all right, so we can. That means we can queue up some more stuff over here. I will do the biome engineering, since I don't think our farm dome had any vistas around it. So that would be a nice and useful addition. I'm really thinking of skipping the low G engineering and maybe going straight to the Mega Dome. Maybe we'll do that next. Because, um, yeah, and this could be like a bigger sort of. I don't know. Maybe it would be best to have the Mega Dome for. Hmm. I'm not sure to be honest what I'm what I'm trying to say. Water is Oh, that's the one we wanted. Farm hydroponic farm and fungal farm upgrade. Less workers, but no, there was another thing. This year. What was it that the infirmaries give you? Give you like um uh, uh there it is. An upgrade uh, so they get um, comfort relaxation hmm an atmosphere would be nice as well actually the first thing we should go for is starting to what is it um, plant some grass and and things but we're gonna need some seeds then so maybe we need to leave one of the farms up to start producing seeds for us. Actually, let's do, it, let's do it this way. And let's speed up the time once again. Because yeah, everything else, it's it's Research very complete. quick to get those uh, percentages up over here. But the vegetation, it just takes a very long time. Alright, we've got the apartments. Now, do we want to start putting in some apartments straight away is the question. I mean, here, kind of, yes, it would be good to do so. So then we can have a bigger farm production here. So we could, yeah, we could technically have just one apartment that covers all the farms if we research farm automation. Yeah, let's do that. So that way this one farm with one... Um, what is it? The um, apartment could take care of uh, yeah, all of our food problems for the time being. And that's still going up. Let's see, we got 22 vacancies. How's that? Uh. Oh yeah, I guess we got some people in school now. Um, what do we need? I think it's gonna probably gonna focus on the engineers, but we want we want a few botanists over here. I'm not sure if you want to remove. Mm -mm -mm. 
put in another one because that means our productions are gonna stall i think yeah we already don't have enough workers in here amplify maybe we'll do amplify then since our power i think is very still very good in here yeah let's amplify this it's gonna take some polymers but yeah we're okay on that oh yeah we really need to rush into machine machine factory in here so maybe this is the place where we need to i don't know like put in apartments once this farm gets out of the way and these are all fully automated now maybe we'll do the same yeah i think this location should be fine let's uh 36 electronics but uh, this is getting yeah four per soul but i would want those three workers yeah i do want those three workers so let's do let's do that and here okay right how many low okay so we've already taken out quite a few rare metals from here and not to worry because we're, we're not selling them uh, back back on earth uh, well basically since there's no point really I mean because the money we can earn from that isn't really gonna get us anything useful we need to produce everything locally locally over here now I'd really want to reduce the amount of workers in, in in this factory though research complete another research done drone printing okay that is cool although with um, how things are right now we can't really build it just yet I think another research we should really queue up now and make it our priority is this one here yeah so they graduate faster let's go for this first it's only 3000 so that's all good and okay let's uh, let's keep it this way and maybe we'll get some hmm yeah let's wait for the research to be done and then maybe we'll open up like the morning session here as well so that's good can we have a bit of an overview here or not uh, I thought there was a way to see how close they are uh, hmm I don't know maybe I just can't find it right now but okay let's uh, let's let's see food cover crops are getting there so that's good yeah I'm really thinking of putting a oh we need another ramp in here as well because uh, the drones do have to take a very long way around I think actually no but anyways it would be still nice to uh, this fuel is like right in the way I think let's get rid of this and no come on uh, and then we could put the ramp I think right in the middle here is fine all right so I think now okay so capture the meteors is ongoing right now another 12 hours till we have it land I think we'll send you out for a bit of automation here let's see oh he's brought in a lot of concrete I think that should keep us afloat for for quite a while and with the school and stuff let's see uh, comfort and sanity is fine in those tomes let's see and yeah it seems pretty good except the farming dome 
Let's see what's uh, no shopping. Aren't you? Uh... Oh, this one's the shopping one. Mm hmm. Oh, we should have put them on different schedules. Yeah, that should help us. So they're all um, not rushing into the service buildings at the same time. That's quite important. I think the rest should be okay. Yeah. Meteor incoming. All right, and here comes the. Oh, that's not quite. Oh no, that's. Ooh, thank you, MDS. Thought we we're gonna lose 180 fuel over there, but it seems we. This depot lives to see another day, or so. Completed it. Okay, so Meteor Storm is now coming in. Let's just see where it is over there. Our transport rover is working in this location, and that is actually a good one. There's so many polymers in here. Uh, let me just hover over it. There's 33, 16, a couple more. Yeah, this whole area over here has been hammered Anomaly found. by the Meteor, so it's going to be good to... You know, 300 metals, for example. That's the whole reason I haven't built any metal extractors just yet. I mean, we don't need them. We can just keep calling meteors down and uh, I think we're we're pretty good. So let's land you... I don't know. Let's, let's, let's bring you over here for the time being. Anomaly found. Oh, two more anomalies. Nice. Very good. End of an age. The day Let's see. claimed our last living founder. Spelling the end of an era for us all. Ah, the founder Clarence Williams died. Cause old age. And that is the last uh, original founder colonist uh, gone now. Alright, that means everyone on Mars now is Martian born. Which means they uh, no one's gonna take sanity damage from the from the disaster, so that's good. Uh, I mean, it is very sad that Williams, Mr. Williams, is is in uh, Mars heaven now. I think, and uh, yeah, very Research very sad. Complete. All right, so they will graduate faster from the university now. Uh, Seventeen homeless people. Alright, you guys, stop making babies, please. We've got quite a few on our hands already. So, yeah. Homes is is definitely an issue. I think we wanted to change the survivor to enthusiast over here as well. High morale. But that's not really... No one's really having high morale, are they? Not really, except this dome in here. They're pretty good for the time being. We have 17 homeless people in this dome. What are we, what are we gonna do with them? Now, option number one is to go with the plan that I was talking about before. We could put a, a apartments over here. I'm just thinking, are we... If we're gonna expand, that means we're, we're not gonna have any any space to pull the pull the tunnels. So yeah, bigger domes are gonna be needed soon. Maybe we should have even gone for this because I mean a medium dome is already already fantastic. I don't know, or we get this one mega dome done that gives us research points and, and stuff as well, and then queue up one of the wonders after that. But I'm still hoping to get one of the, I don't know, different ones. Uh, what shall we do? Megadome is quite a big research undertaking, so maybe we'll go with the low-G engineering after all. Because that could be um, a good... A good one for uh, for our manufacturing dome if we wanted to. Yeah, we probably want it a little bit bigger because there's so many people um, that we need in those factories, so... 
and that means a lot of services but we don't have any more space for the services in here so that's yeah that's a bit of a bottleneck but okay so that's being researched now i don't really know if we need this but uh should we bump it once again most things are fairly quick Oh, mm. you know what? Let, let's just leave it. Because that means we won't have to have make too many babies in here either. But okay, uh, let's call it an episode over here. Let's end this for the uh, for this time. Uh, in the next one, hoping to figure out this little food production. Uh, well, it's, I can't really call it an issue, but um, I, I do want to close this loop over here. We've got this all quality up in both, I believe. Yes, we do. So that means we can rearrange things in here, put an apartment anomaly someplace found. as well. We found another anomaly, so uh, we can definitely boost the research now as well. So thank you very much for joining. Um, hope you're all being safe and uh, leave uh, leave a comment if you have some tips for, uh, for building this as well. I do love to see them. So, so yeah. Thanks again and see you in the next episode.